Hello everyone, it's Miss Robson here and today I thought I would read you a story. Now this story says, open very carefully, a book with a bite. We better be careful. Now, under here it says the ugly duckling, but then it says open very carefully. Let's see. Once upon a time, there was a mother duck with three pretty ducklings and one... Wait a minute, what's that? I'm trying to read you the story of the ugly duckling, but there's something in this book that shouldn't be here. Hang on, where's it gone now? Perhaps it's escaped. Or could it be hiding? Do you dare to keep looking? You do? Then let's turn the page very, very carefully. It's a crocodile. A really big, scary one. What's he doing in this book? He might bite your finger or scratch your nose. I've heard crocodiles like to do that. Stay back just in case. Watch out, he's on the move. What is he doing? He's eating the letters. He must be hungry. I think his favourite letters to eat are O oh and S. S -t -p. Mr Crocodile, you I can't eat the letter. Now he's gobbling up whole words and sentences. We can't have a book without words. What will we read if there aren't any sentences? We've got to make him stop. What could we do? Let's try rocking the book backwards and forwards. That's it, look, he's nodding off. Ah, he's sleeping like a baby. I know. Let's find a crayon. If you're going to eat our words, Mr Crocodile, then we're going to draw on you. Shh! He's not such a scary crocodile now. Oh no! Maybe he is a scary crocodile after all. All that drawing has woken him up. And he's not looking too happy about it, that too, too. Crocodiles don't do ballet. Watch out. It looks as if he's had enough of this book. I think he's going to make a run for it. Here he goes. Ouch. Well, who would have thought it was so hard to get out of a book? Maybe if you shake the book, he'll fall out. Oh, let's give it a shake. Shake, 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 shake. Hmm, that didn't work either. But look, he's worked out what to do. He's munching a hole through the page. And he's nearly out. Goodbye, Mr Crocodile. I wasn't scared. Were you? I wonder where he'll end up next. I hope you enjoyed reading that story with me. It was lovely to share it.